To hold a grudge is definitely not a good thing. To hold a grudge means you're staying angry about something for way too long. If my friend said something really mean to me, I might be really angry about it, but usually I can just forgive them and I move on. But if I'm kind of a bitter person and I hold a lot of grudges, maybe he says something mean to me and for one year, two years, three years, I'm still angry about it three years later, I would be holding a grudge. And that's definitely not a good trait to have. Dan, can you explain, instead of holding a grudge, what would you have to do in order to continue to have a good relationship with your friends? Like I said earlier, holding a grudge is not a good trait to have. So for us to be better people, we usually won't want to let that go. We want to be able to forgive them as much as possible. You know, we just don't want to hold on to all the little things because then we'll just be really angry people all the time. One way to get rid of your grudge is to always speak your mind, right? To tell the truth right when it happens. That way you won't have to hold a grudge about things. You won't have to hold it in. If you speak your mind, then maybe you guys can work out both sides of what's wrong with the problem. Any final words to our viewers? If you guys don't buy our book, I will hold a grudge against you. Huh? No, I'm just kidding. I won't hold a grudge against you. But I want you guys to learn English as much as possible. So keep watching our videos, buy our book, do whatever you can to learn English. Look, look, English. 자 오늘 준비한 표현은 바로 hold a grudge라는 표현입니다. Grudge. 이 grudge라는 표현은요, 쉽게 말하면 이런 거예요. 안 좋은 감정을 여기다가 꿍 하고 이렇게 있는 그런 것을 생각해 한번 보시면 되겠습니다. 그래서 hold가 잡다라는 거니까 hold a grudge. 이러한 꿍한 감정을 계속해서 쌓아두고 그와 같은 것을 가지고 있는 느낌이죠. 여러분들 그 친구들하고 싸워보신 경험 있나요? 남친이 될 수도 있고 여친이 될 수도 있겠고 와이프가 될 수도 있고 허스번드가 될 수도 있겠죠. 싸우고 나서 말 안하고 그냥 꽁한 사람들이 많습니다. 그쵸? 그런 사람들이 바로 hold a grudge 하는 거예요. 여러분들 그렇게 하는 게 아니라 솔직하게 마음을 오픈하고 그쵸? speak your mind 한번 해보세요. 그런 다음에 진지한 대화를 해보세요. 그러면요 여러분들 여러분들 관계가 계속해서 나아질 거라고 생각합니다. You can hold a grudge against someone. Um, maybe they've pissed you off or they said something behind your back or whatever. Again. You can hold a grudge against someone. Um, maybe they've pissed you off or they said something behind your back or whatever. Again. You can hold a grudge against someone. Um, maybe they've pissed you off or they said something behind your back or whatever. Again. You can hold a grudge against someone. Um, maybe they've pissed you off or they said something behind your back or whatever. You can hold a grudge against someone. Um, maybe they've pissed you off or they said something behind your back or whatever. I guess I do hold a grudge for a little bit just because it stays stuck in my head and I'll just be mad about it. I guess I do hold a grudge for a little bit just because it stays stuck in my head and I'll just be mad about it. I guess I do hold a grudge for a little bit just because it stays stuck in my head and I'll just be mad about it. I guess I do hold a grudge for a little bit. Just because it stays stuck in my head and I'll just be mad about it. I guess I do hold a grudge for a little bit. Just because it stays stuck in my head and I'll just be mad about it. Now I know from personal experience that letting somebody off the hook who hurt me or who offended me can be really hard to do. It just feels so good to hold a grudge against them, doesn't it? But what's the truth? The truth is that grudge is only hurting me. Now I know from personal experience that letting somebody off the hook who hurt me or who offended me can be really hard to do. It just feels so good to hold a grudge against them, doesn't it? But what's the truth? The truth is that grudge is only hurting me. Now I know from personal experience that letting somebody off the hook who hurt me or who offended me can be really hard to do. It just feels so good to hold a grudge against them, doesn't it? But what's the truth? The truth is that grudge is only hurting me. Now I know from personal experience that letting somebody off the hook who hurt me or who offended me can be really hard to do. It just feels so good to hold a grudge against them, doesn't it? But what's the truth? The truth is that grudge is only hurting me. Now I know from personal experience that 
letting somebody off the hook who hurt me or who offended me can be really hard to do. It just feels so good to hold a grudge against them, doesn't it? But what's the truth? The truth is that grudge is only hurting me. 오늘 표현 꽁하다, hold a grudge 라는 표현 알아봤고요. 우리 다음 시간에 또 좋은 표현을 가지고 찾아뵙도록 하겠습니다. See you guys next time. Bye bye.